Pranam to all. How are you? I hope you are all fine. To maintain an healthy and beautiful garden, the main thing that you need is the soil. And nitrogenous fertilizer is the best fertilizer that can also help you make a beautiful and healthy garden. Research has established that nitrogenous fertilizer has deleterious effect on the soil health and crop productivity if used over a long time. This is also possible to nitrate contamination in groundwater. My mom believes that if we use organic fertilizer, then it will be good for us, for our plants, for our soil and even for the environment. Look, Choti is enjoying digging the soil. In our channel, we have uploaded a lot of homemade organic fertilizer. Today, I will tell you about another fertilizer which has three big nutrients termed NPK that is nitrogen, phosphorus and potassium. Tea is much more than just warm and comforting beverage. But most of the times we throw away the tea leaves that we used. But do you know it's a natural powerhouse ingredient to use in your garden soil? But the question is, how do we use it? First, wash your tea leaves and then store it in a big jar. Then add 5 to 10 ml of the magic liquid. Do you know what it is? Yes, it's the bioenzyme. After one month, your compost will be ready. There's a lot of reason about why we should use tea leaf compost. At the beginning, we already told the first reason as it is a great source of NPK. When you are making your garden soil, then you can add 50% of this compost and 50% of your normal soil. Mix it thoroughly, then keep it in a place for 2-3 to three days, then plant your plant into this soil. The second point is, it helps plant retain water as it has substitute of cocoa pit. And this soil gives earth from healthy food. Now, you all must be wondering, why would I want earthworms in my garden? As it turns out, earthworms provide many benefits to your garden, including helping fertilize your soil. By recycling your leftover tea leaves, you are providing these little soil workers with a nutritious food source. The fourth point is to protect your plant from soil fungus. 
Sometimes one of a precious plant gets infected by a mysterious fungal infection. If this happens, just put this compost all over your soil. It works like magic. You all know we have some cats in our garden who destroy our plants. So the fifth point is to keep your nosy cat out of your garden. Simply sprinkle the tea leaf compost directly on your soil. It's a quick, natural and effective way to keep your favorite furry friend at bay. I hope this video will help you very much so you can make your own tea leaf compost and help your plants grow healthy and strong. Thank you for watching. Stay safe, stay healthy. Bye-bye.